And up next, we have qualifier number three. We're on the pace here. Three-year-old pacers. Jonathan Drury will drive number seven. Prove them wrong. So the three-year-old fillies get called in this field of eight. The first one we'll meet is number one, Gimme a Corona, Jody Jamison, driving for trainer Trevin Shive. Two is Storybook Bella, trained by Rob Fellows, Trevor Henry Steers. Three, Star So Bright. Greg McNair trains, Doug McNair drives. Four is Big Big Plans, Bob McIntosh the trainer, James McDonald the driver. Five is Charming Vixen, Blake McIntosh trains, Bob McClure in the sulky. Six is Horizontal, Kevin Ben the trainer, the driver Sylvan Fillion. Seven is Prove Em Wrong, Anthony Beaton trains, make the driver Jonathan Drury. And the eight is Lions Better Day, also trained by Beaton, Louis Waugh will steer. Horses on gate for qualifier number three. Here they come. And they're off and pacing. And from the center going forward goes Horizontal as she is going to roll out to the early lead. Storybook Bella is getting away in second. Here from the outside is Lions Better Day who will look to land in third. In front of Big Big Plans in fourth. From the rail is Gimme a Corona. Then behind that one is Star So Bright. On the outside is Charming Vixen. And your early trailer is Prove Em Wrong. Horizontal into the first turn. Philly on trying to straighten that one out. Maybe a little shy of those shadows. But everybody gets by them. And the opening quarter is going to pop up on the board in 30 seconds flat. So they're going to move into the back stretch, and it's Horizontal, your leader. This daughter of Always Be Mickey had a nice rookie campaign, competed in some of the biggest events around here, including the She's a Great Lady and the Breeders' Crown, but she's going to hand over the lead now because from third, here comes a rush from Lions Better Day, who is surging up to the lead, racing in third as they go by the midway point. Uh, it is going to be Storybook Bella, who is being tracked in fourth by Big Big Plans. The half was hit in 57 and four, so they were scooting right along, and you could see it there as they got some separation up at the front second quarter was paced in 27 and 4 even quicker for lions better day and lions better day is the leader horizontal in second storybook bella in third big big plans is in fourth four lengths and going back to give me a corona to the outside comes charming vixen and then it is star so bright and the trailers prove them wrong it is lions better day coming to three quarters with horizontal right on her helmet they're past three quarters in 126 and four off the turn and into the stretch lions better day brings them into the lane We'll try and get away on Horizontal in second. Behind in third is Storybook Bella. Center of the track, big, big plans. And widest of them all is Charming Vixen. Final eighth of the mile. Lions better day. Here's Horizontal taking a shot on the outside, trying to surge on by. And Horizontal will strike the lead in the final 16th. It's Horizontal to win it. Finishing the second, Lions better day. On the outside, big, big plans was third. And fourth was Storybook Bella. 154 flat for Horizontal.